DNA based skin care. Is that exciting you? Just hold on, there are a few limitations. It is to determine what your genes are making your skin do or reacting. Is your collagen deteriorating faster? Are you reacting too bodily to oxidative stress? Are you being reactive to wear inflammation? All of this is marked with your individual gene. And then a cream is prepared accordingly. For me, at this point of time, I would rather ask you all these questions while I am doing a consultation asking how your mom and dad aged or reacted. Did they have pigmentation? Did they have acne? And quite a lot of information I'm already gathering, right? So I don't need a specific testing. Two, it is too early in the process yet. So there is so much more to be done in the future. Maybe that is it. But right now, not. Third most important thing is it's not just genes, it's epigenetic. There is a lot more than genes that which actually affects how your skin reacts to every stimuli. That's what we call as epigenetics, which is your lifestyle, which is your environmental damage, which is what you actually put onto your skin and into your mouth. So me giving you a customized, personalized concoction or two, three creams together makes more sense than simply sending your saliva to a lab and getting a cream for you. Thank you.